Oh. Someone's put a barrier on it? It's attacking him! <gasps> Ooh! Betty! Yo, it's your boy Betty, and today we do have some more Mob Psycho with episode 4. And listen, last week's episode T something that I was not expecting, and I'm very excited to see. Obviously, the founders arrived, and that's the name of this episode. So, yeah, hit the like and subscribe button, especially if you enjoy videos like this. And uh, yeah, let's get right into some Mob Psycho. Yeah, why didn't you turn up, Snake? Science happened. You totally forgot about them. That's when he appeared. The true founder. Wow, so even she's turned believer. Sorry about that but by the way. It just, it just came out. I, I'm sorry. <laughs> so people are forgetting stuff. That's the second person talking about forgetting something. See? And I ended up way more interested in that than the universe. No longer the telepathy club. Branch of the Psycho help? Really? He's taken over like that? We will pray! Okay, sorry. But Mob, are you just gonna let that happen? He's obviously pretending to be you. He doesn't seem to care. <laughs> No, these are the cracks. I'm guessing that's because of the um, broccoli supernatural phenomena. Mm. Plant roots, yeah. It's all connected. Yeah, it's growing maybe across the city. Busting through reinforced steel and concrete to scar for nutrients, right? Yeah. The divine tree. <laughs> Doesn't bring money? Yeah, no, you're not slightly responsible. <laughs> you're not just slightly, okay. Okay. Oh my god, wait, if they do that, they, the, but wait, the psycho helmet religion prays to it. That means Mob's gonna go head up against the leader, straight up. Yeah, see? Wait, they're feeding people stuff from the divine tree? Is that... Is that a smart thing to do? Divine... So everyone's having some of the divine... You guys are crazy. What if everyone becomes slightly psychic because of it? Something's happening. What? Wow! Nice! Yeah! It's leveled up already! Okay. Let's go. He's gonna try and destroy it. Jeez! This leveled up. Oh! Someone's put a barrier on it? It's attacking him! <gasps> oh my god, do you see the way that the grass is shaped for it to kind of represent this like- Oh, he made a sword with his tiger. Psycho helmet. There's the leader. It's not. Kami? Wait, no! 
The brainwashing, he's still affected by it. No. No way. Empty? Oh, he broke free! Let's go, my boy! That was slick. Who are you? Oh. <laughs> Sono Tori Kamida. He's controlling the whole broccoli and you're fighting inside it. Ooh, this is slick. Gotcha. Hey, go, Mama, a hundred percent. Oh, you could so Ooh, Why are you slick with it like that? <laughs> oh, in this episode level, no. <laughs> I don't think it's over, bro. Uh oh. Hey, mob, we need you, bro. Oh no, he's gonna get what? He can sense it, yeah, he knows what's going on. Wait, this season, I love that they've carried this on. Like the the plot from the last season, I'm loving this and where it's going potentially. It's sucking his energy as well, or has he been brainwashed? Oh no, yeah, he's he's had his energy sucked. He knows him. Dimples! I knew you were snaking it! Oh my god, what a twist! What? I knew, I knew he was up to something. I've been saying that the last few reactions. Just like, where's Dimples? He's plotting something. That makes total sense. So he's fused himself with the broccoli and then used the broccoli to recover some of his spiritual energy like the energy that he lost obviously when he went against Kagayama that's why he's getting more powerful and of course why he has knowledge on the psycho helmet religion knows how to obviously maneuver it and also Kagayama's allies like that is great dimples you are a snake man What's the point? Ooh. Ooh. Dimples, man! That was really great to like you. I can't believe you're snaking us. Damn, man. The trails, why? <laughs> no, no, Reagan, it ain't that. This is so, this is something different. Lift it up with psychic powers, carry it off, sink it near I don't know if, that, if it's that simple. And actually, wouldn't it be better to take it somewhere like really cold, like maybe the Arctic? And then just have it like frozen underneath? Like an ice layer? Damn, bro, I can't believe Dimples is snaking it like that. And I'm worried a little bit, you know, because he looks like he's like powered up. 
No, it's not impossible. Facts, man. <laughs> and that's facts, you know. Ooh, we're going to see the Kageyama brothers versus Dimple. And he looks like he's like suspecting that signs up. Yep, Reagan. And that's a lot of people, yo. We don't actually know if the effects will just disappear if they destroy the train. The broccoli. <laughs> they keep calling it a tree, but I have to remember it's a broccoli. Mmm. Mmm, that's facts. <laughs> no, not this. If he eats it and he connects to dimples, does that mean dimples will now know? Like, yeah, will dimples know what's going on because of the connection that he builds with Ritsu? Like, is that a thing? Wait, really? Yeah, I don't have it now. Smart. So Ritsu is the one that might turn on us, right? Okay. Yeah, because Ritsu will try and protect the tree now. Now it'll be brainwashed. In fact, it won't even be Dimples who will just like be aware. It'll be Ritsu that turns on them. See, he's already turning them away from it. Yeah, nowhere near the tree. See, he's already converted. Oh my god, here we go. Oh my god. He's gonna fight Ritsu! He's gonna fight Ritsu! Ooh. Ooh, here we go! Obviously Ritsu's gonna get murked, but I feel like he's gonna try really hard and not really be able to do much to mob. Hey, don't look at me like that, yo. <laughs> I ain't sitting down with these creeps. Uh, nah. Obviously not. <laughs> yeah, run! <laughs> as if they let him go though. Oh, what about Hanazawa? Are we gonna have them as enemies? Oh my god, actually, when I think about it, if Dimples is able to convert even psychics over to his side, Ritsu... Kanazawa, like maybe even others from like you know the, the the groups we fought against, like that could be that could be problematic. So I'm wondering if this will actually happen in that manner. Mana, like Takazawa, is it Takazawa? Serizawa. Come on, you know this. You're a psychic. Oh no 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 no! We need him to go 100% right now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, don't take off that. Don't put, put the jacket back on. He's <laughs> put the eye on the fence, please. Oh no. They're starting to turn a little bit aggressive. Oh, now we got psychics coming. Yeah, run! <laughs> <laughs> Damn, Dimples! I mean, the plan is actually relatively smart, I guess, if you want to be a, like, you know, in that sort of position. When they find out it's, it's Dimples, though, if he's some kind of villain, let's free everyone from the brainwashing. Yeah. Dimples. 
<laughs> I can't believe it's Dimples. That's so funny. Which he is. Um, now when he finds out it's Dimples. In a way, there was a true founder and it was Dimples though. Reagan? Damn, he's been brainwashed. How? Did you have a candy, Reagan? Oh, he's gone. Are we gonna see Hanazawa here? Yeah. No? Wait, really? They're celebrating more? Oh, it's Bomi's here as well. Psycho Helmet! Psycho Helmet! <laughs> Oh no, let's play this for the next episode, but interesting. I I will admit I was not expecting it to be dimples. I mean it makes sense, obviously we got teased in episode two, was it? But I really got thrown. Like I really did not see that coming. Everyone getting brainwashed also didn't see that coming. Hanazawa's fight at the beginning was dope. Man, there's so many interesting developments. And I'm wondering now, obviously, like, Dimples has clearly got stronger, because obviously he's fused himself with the broccoli. <laughs> and clearly been using, you know, that as a gateway, really, to gain some life force, um, you know, um, while he's merged. So he's obviously become more powerful, as it was showcased between his flight with, obviously, Hanazawa. I do like the new form. I do. It makes him... Kind of dope! <laughs> so I absolutely love this video. Of course, let's get right into the review portion of this and uh, let's stay set. So that was Mob Psycho with episode 4. Definitely an interesting plot of events. I can't believe, I literally cannot believe Dimples is that guy. <laughs> but again, it does make sense. I'm curious to see what that conversation is going to be like between Mob and Dimples. I'm also curious to see what's happened to Hanazawa as well. Obviously, things are about to get heated because we can see that Mob is close to exploding. So when he gets to that 100%, um, <laughs> Dimples, it's, it's over man, let's be real. But I absolutely love this. Of course, let me know what you guys thought and definitely drop those thoughts down in the comments. Of course, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like button. But if you're a new viewer, hit the subscribe button, especially if you want to see more content like this. So we will obviously be doing episode five next week. But for everyone else that has shown love, thanks as always. This, of course, has been your boy Betty, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.